Hi guys, I'm Merle. And I'm Carol. And I have a confession to make. I was tagged by Massachusetts Prepper a couple of days ago to do a five question garden tag. And being the old forgetful geezer that I am, I actually forgot that we had done one very early in our YouTube career, <laughs> which is not all that long to start with. But rather than to go back on my word, and since we did it in the winter time, and we had absolutely nothing in the garden, and the fence tore, torn down and, and all that, I thought it was time for a part two anyway. So, we're gonna go ahead and do those questions. But before we do that, let me show you what the garden looked like back when we did it the first time. And this is it. What we're showing here is uh, about, uh, what is it, six truckloads of seasoned black Angus cow manure. Uh, and every gardener wants to have something like that. Okay, and the first question is, why do we garden? And the answer is... Oh, you like to take that? Yes. We garden because we love fresh vegetables, and we love to grow our own food. We like to know where it came from and how it's grown, and we like to put things up for the winter so that uh, we have our own food. And it just that's doesn't, about it. Just doesn't get any better than having no. having your own, especially in the summertime when you can go out in the garden and, and get pretty much whatever you want to bring in and eat. Um, we do spend gobs of time in the fall though when everything is plentiful canning and filling the pantry and uh, we used to think that um, maybe one year's worth of food was was plenty but we think lately that probably two years minimum is the way to go and that is why we garden. And number two is why do we YouTube? I'll try to grab that. I'm a kind of a the kind of a guy that likes to do electronic things and this that and the other and I and another fellow who uh, is his name is uh, Giles Warham started a show uh, actually a live show and it's called uh, world of live streaming and uh, that was about a year ago so that thing has grown almost <laughs> at a, a rate that you would that's hard to believe but at any rate I enjoy doing video and uh, you know be it live video or, or what have you and uh, the complications that you can run into and the things that you can learn are just, you know, it's a challenge. I, I guess I would put it that way. Uh, but mostly the reason that we YouTube right now is because we absolutely love the community, the homesteading community. And we don't care if you're in a, uh, in a two-room apartment or a 2,000-acre ranch. We're, we're all doing the best we can with what we got. And uh, I think that's what it's all about. And number three is how long have we gardened? And Carol will be answering that one. Well, come May, we'll be married 50 years and we've gardened all of our married life. And I gardened when I was a kid with my grandma and my mom. Uh, if we didn't garden, we didn't eat. So that was a good motivator. But I love gardening. Yeah, she, uh, you know, in the wintertime, she'll get flowers and we've, we've, we've <laughs> looks like a greenhouse all around our, our home here. Uh, she just can't keep her fingers out of the dirt. So we are long-time gardeners, though she's done more gardening than I have, and uh, she knows what she's doing. But we, 
have been learning a lot too. We're going to do raised beds this year, which we've never done, and um, adding to our clay soil the uh, the black Angus manure that that I showed you a minute ago. You know, build that build that soil up. If it's if it's no good, put in it whatever you need to. All the leaf molds that we the leaves that we've collected and uh, broke down. Yeah takes a lot of work, but mm -hmm. uh, if you enjoy it, uh, that's, that's what it's all about. Number four, what do we grow? We grow a little bit of everything. Um, tomatoes, peppers, onions, garlic, leek, broccoli, cauliflower, cabbage, collards, kale, turnips, turnip greens. Just about anything that you can grow in all kinds of lettuce in central indiana weather yes. we do now our garden is, may not be as big as some so some of the things that takes a lot of room like uh, watermelons and and those v big viney things sometimes we don't do as many of those as we'd like because we need the space for other things but uh, boy i sure do like my okra i'll tell you that uh, yeah and yeah, we both do. Yeah, we do, yeah, for sure. And the last question is, what is our favorite vegetable to grow? Tomatoes. I almost have to agree. You know, tomatoes are, seem to be the first thing that we, that we want to get ripe so we can get them in the house and, and, get, them, and get to yes. eating them. So, yeah, I think we're going to have to go with that. Wow, almost forgot one of the most important parts of the video, and that is to tag two more people to carry this on. And uh, the first will be uh, Yellow Jacket Farms. They are a small channel, but they've got a lot of good content, and I, I'm hopeful that they will accept this uh, tag and that they will carry on. And the second one is Brian's Garden Spot, a fellow that's not all that far from me, that has a really, really beautiful garden and also a fairly small channel, and I'm hoping that he will also accept the, the uh, challenge of uh, doing the garden tag. So that was our attempt at uh, part two of uh, Five Question Garden Tag. So we hope we didn't bore some of our old time watchers and uh, maybe some of you new folks got a chance to see something you hadn't seen before. So for Merle and Carol at Micro Homesteaders, we'll see you on the next video.